right, welcome back for our next community conversation today. We are joined by Craig Jennings, the choral music teacher at Jackson P. Burley Middle School. Thank you so much for being here with us. Thank you for having me. I'm so I happy did, to be here. Yes, I can't believe it's been a year, it really is. but we have a, uh, an exciting concert coming up. Tell us what's coming up and, and how people can check this out. Absolutely. The Winter Songs concert to benefit the shelter for help in emergency is Saturday, the 25th of um, February at 5 p.m. at Monticello High School. Um, and it features um, nine ensembles from eight different schools, and it is our answer, we're using art to answer violence against women. Yeah. And um, while the, sh the concert itself is uh, free, we do encourage donations to the Shelter for Help and Emergency at the door. Yeah, and it's a, it's a place that does so much good They're work. Amazing. Um, tell us a little bit about how this all got started and kind of the significance of the timing of the show. Sure, absolutely. And it, it, it's stunning to think that it's been nine years, but uh, nine years ago, the disappearance of UVA student Hannah Graham. Uh, when she disappeared under the cameras on the downtown mall, uh, my students at the time were, were, were having sort of a surreal crisis. This, is this real life? Yeah. And there's no answer to that. Uh, and there's no answer to it as an adult, let alone as a 13-year-old. So we decided, my colleagues and I, to take our, our treble ensembles and bring them together for a day of sharing and mutual empowerment um, to find some sort of good from this hideous event. And, um, and so we've been doing this now for nine years where we get together and there's a different topic every year. Last year was uh, intimate partner violence. This year it's um, messages that erode healthy self-esteem yeah. and how to spot them, how to uh, uh, develop strategies to sort of armor yourself against them and, and, and reestablish yourself as simply just being an adequate human being in the skin you were born in. So we'll get together uh, and, and have classes with the Shelter for Help and Emergency all day and then bring our musicians together to perform that afternoon in support of the shelter. That is wonderful. Tell us um, which performers will spectators uh, see on stage? Kind of what kind of performances and music can they expect? Sure. Well, we do have we have nine ensembles and I, I'm, I'm, I'm terrified I'll leave somebody out. So I'll just say our local middle schools and our local high schools are all bringing um, their, their treble ensembles, generally their women's choruses. Uh, and, and often they will select music that is uh, on the side of um, a women's empowerment anthem. For instance, my ensemble, uh, they're gonna be doing uh, Leslie Gore's You Don't Own Me oh, and okay. Above and Beyond's On a Good Day yeah. for the concert. And they are just wrecking it. They're, just, uh, they're so much fun to be around. Oh. And, and they, they like singing with each other and they're careful with each other's feelings. And so all of the ensembles are gonna be uh, working on that. Uh, that that's sort of like you know um, tangent. They're going to be looking to empower each other, and at the end of the concert, they are going to be doing a um, an arrangement of Jess Glynn's "I'll Be There" that I did for them, and they'll for, there'll be 200 voices on the stage wow. just like laying it out. So oh. it's going to be fantastic. It's hard to beat that. So, yeah. yeah. So and um, and again, you know, uh, we are this close to topping $30,000 in donations for the shelter. So hopefully folks who are watching this today will be able to come out and maybe, you know, lend a little bit of money, uh, you know, uh, in support of that goal, getting over 30 grand. Yeah, it's gonna happen. So real quick, right before we sure. go, um, just tell us one more time when this is, how people can go. Thank you. It's the Winter Songs concert to benefit the shelter for help in emergency. It is Saturday, February 25th at five o'clock PM at Monticello High School. All right, it's gonna be wonderful. Thank you so much for being here to tell us about it. Thanks for having me, we yes. really appreciate it. Yes, definitely, we'll have you back soon. Hooray! And we will be right back.